Hey y'all, it's Tia D the Nail Tina here again. So today's video is just, wait, first of all, look at my nose. Um, but this is just gonna be a quick video because I need to head out. This video is actually gonna be about nail shame. Nail shame. When your nails are chipped, yeah, don't you feel disgusted? Like, disgusted with yourself? <laughs> disgusted with life? Don't you feel dirty? Doesn't it just make you feel like, I don't know, why do we feel like that? Like, when you're on the train, you'll be holding on to the pole thing, but you'll be tucking your nails in. Like, God forbid the tube is crowded. Yeah, I'd be literally like, <laughs> but when you're on the tube and you know your shit's ain't done, yeah? And you can see someone with bad nails. Like the other day, oh my gosh, I was due it in for, yeah? For some reason, there were three bitches in a row on the tube opposite me, all nails looking beautiful. I'm just looking at all three. And I've seen women do this before when my nails look laying on the tube. Sometimes I'll sit next to someone and I'm not gonna lie, but if my nails look good that day, I'm gonna rest them on the bag like, And then, I've literally seen it so many times where a woman will be sitting next to me and she'll look at my nails and then they'll look at their nails. Now don't do that. Don't bake up the shame. Don't, even if you look at people's nails and you notice it, don't ever turn back and look at yours after. I'm just letting y'all know. Just letting y'all know. Like, oh, there was one time, that, oh, I haven't had my grip on nails, yeah? Recently. And this couple sat opposite me and the woman, I saw her looking at my nails first and I'm looking at her thinking, okay, but she's staring. I, I hate that. Yeah. She's staring and I knew she was staring because they were long, just because they were mad long. She's staring at them like, not even trying to be polite about it, just. <laughs> and then her boyfriend's looking and then she's whispered something to her boyfriend and then this, her boyfriend started to look at my damn nails. Then I've looked at her nails. You even have nothing on your nails? The cheek, the audacity. The brightness, bright, she bright, she bright. So I'm looking at her nails and I'm thinking, girl, if you don't stop because I stop. And then, um, and then he said something back and then she started to look at her nails. The tube is, I swear, the nail war zone. Like that's the place where you will go and feel baited up like, Nail wise, I don't know what it is about the tube, but that place there makes you nail conscious. I don't know why. Um, anyway, but yeah, I just felt like I needed to vent. <laughs> I've got some shorter nails right now. So somebody probably will be like, oh my God, they're bright. <laughs> Low my up. Um, I even got no designs on them, but we'll see. And but yeah, that was just something I thought was quite funny because I talk about it with clients sometimes, but when they come and sit at my table, before they give me their hands, they'll be like, I'm so sorry, my nails are such a state, they're really in bad condition, I had a really bad day and I was doing the gardening and everything else happened in life. I'm thinking, I don't care. As long as your nails aren't like mad disgusting, like, I don't care. I don't care if your nails are chipped. No offense, love y'all, want the best for you and your nails, but when people come in, I'm so sorry, I'm a bit off this, this now. So sorry. That one thing I just, Why are you apologizing to me, child? It's your nails that gonna be back off. Um and as I said, I love y'all. I want the best for you, but respectfully. Us nail techs don't care. When you come in, you sit at our tables and you apologize about the state of your nails. Don't apologize to us. It's not our nails. We ain't gonna look at them shits all day. Getting judged on the tube. That's a you thing, innit? So don't apologize to me. Apologize to yourself. I'm joking. I'm joking. <laughs> uh, God. Um, but yeah, I've got I've I've got so much stuff to do today, and here I am doing the most and the least at the same damn time. Um, instead of just moving, vlogging things, I do want to get back to the focus of what it is that I'm here for, and that's for nails. Obviously, you're still gonna be conducting my crazy activities and stuff, but yeah, this video in particular, just like the how to manage gripper nails, <laughs> this one is about hand shame, having chipped nails in public. Because, as I said, 
you actually feel dirty like for having the chip nails with me and other clients have, have spoke about this you feel like you've just come off the street <laughs> uh, i don't know how to explain it so anyway so one way to prolong the manicure or to kind of avoid feeling so bad about that let me just quickly say is getting a natural color here i am neon pink now telling you get a natural color but i'm the nail dealer like they can just do my ink for free like literally if money's tight if you want to stretch out your manis whatever the best thing i can recommend is getting a natural color even if you get a bit of nail out on top of the natural color but once that starts to grow out you don't really notice even if it chips you're not really gonna notice it even the other day i was looking at a, nail, a, a woman's nails on the tube you know her nails and they were like really 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 natural nude and i noticed after like looking for a good couple of minutes at this gal like raw at least two of your nails is off you know like off and they had acrylics in it so i'm like oh wow well damn she can't fool me me and her so trust and believe that works natural colors help you to blend especially on the tube if you have any chipped things or if you know you're, you're not going to get your nails done for a long time get i would suggest get something natural looking get something nudie um but yeah i'm gonna get out as i said i've got so much stuff to do today and yeah the day is fading away so yeah i hope you guys have a lovely one and i'll see you in the next video